praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Prayer against backsliding. Prayer against backsliding. Brethren, this is prayer that we don't need to joke with. This is prayer that we need to pray daily. When you backslide, you disobey the commandment of God. Who is a backslider? A person who for one reason get out from the thought of God. Who is out of fellowship with God. A backslider is a careless Christian who disobey. Many turn back as a result of their situation or challenges. One thing I want us to know, as a Christian, challenges will come. Terrible situation will appear. But Jesus said, Share up. He has conquered the world. You don't need to be afraid. But sliding always begins in one place. It begins in the heart. You allow something or some activities to have taken over your heart. No longer have time for God. You don't fellowship with the brethren. You don't have time for the things of God. You fall into sin easily from one sin to another. The way you are walking now is not in line with the way that God wants you to walk. For Bible makers understand, in the book of Proverbs chapter 14, verse 12, that there is a way that seems right to a man, but its end is destruction. Its end is death. That's why you need to turn back. For the Bible make us to understand. When we open our Bible to the book of Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse 22. Let's open our Bible to the book of Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse 22. As we read. Say, return, ye backsliding children, and I will heal your backsliding. Behold, we come unto thee, for thou art the Lord our God. God is calling you. God give you an invitation to repent. Come back to him. Don't say I can't come back. God says I will restore you if you come to him. Are you ready to turn to God? Because Bible may us in the book of 2 Chronicles chapter 7 verse 14. That if my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then I will hear from heaven. I will forgive their sin and I will eat their land. Are you ready to turn back from that way and come back to God? Accept God's invitation. Which he has given you. There are a lot of people in the Bible that also backslided. Number one of them is Judas Cariot. Because of money, he betrayed his master. Brethren, another person is Demas. In the book of 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 10, the love of the world, he loved the world more than God. Brethren, God is calling you now. God wants you to turn back to him. Turn back from that way that leads to destruction. We need to come back with confession in our heart and upon our lips as we rejoice in the truth. Are you ready to turn back? When you backslide, your worship life is dull. When you backslide, you kill unbelievers of hope. Your backsliding can be the reason that someone does not get saved and goes to hell. This is serious. Your lifestyle is discouraging unbelievers. When you are vibrant for the things of God, but now not active, you are inactive for the things of God. When you don't have time for prayer, and the word of God. Backsliding starts in prayer. When you start backsliding in your prayer life, you start backsliding everywhere else. When you are cold and feeling 
in your prayer life, you will lose the presence of God. Why did you think that Satan ate praying? He ate praying men and women. You need to readjust your prayer life now. You will backslide if you haven't yet done so. In the book of Matthew chapter 26 verse 41, wash and pray so that you will not fall into temptation. The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. Brethren, are you ready to pray? Are you ready to come back to Jesus? Paraventure, you are listening under the sound of my voice. You have not given your life to the Lord Jesus Christ. You have not accepted Jesus as your Lord and your personal Savior. This is a great opportunity for you to accept Jesus into your life. Have you given your life to the Lord Jesus before? And you are vibrant in the things of God. But just all of a sudden, you turn back. You need to go back to God and ask for the mercy of God. For God to have mercy on you. Are you ready to accept Jesus into your life? If you have made up your mind, I want you to lay your right hand on your chest and you will say after me. Say, Father, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. As from today, I say bye-bye to the devil. I enter into the kingdom of light. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I congratulate us. We have made the right choice for our life. Let us go down on our knees now and begin to confess all our sins. Say, Father, forgive me every area of my life that I've sinned against thee. Father, forgive me, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to confess now. Anything in your life that you have accepted in your heart as an idol that is making you not to be vibrant in the things of God. Those things that is taking your attention away from the things of God. Begin to open your mouth now. Say, Father, forgive me, Lord. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we are forgiven. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. As men that accepted Jesus into their life. Father, save them, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, Lord, baptize them, O Lord, with your Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Father, those that turn back, O Lord, that have come back to you, Lord, accept them, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, King of Glory. Blessed be your name, O Lord. In Jesus' wonderful name we pray. Amen. Let's open our mouth and begin to worship the Lord. Begin to worship the King of Kings. Open your mouth and sing to the Lord wherever you are. Begin to worship the Lord. He is worthy to be praised. Praise the name of the Lord for your life. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Father, we praise you. We praise you. Daddy, we praise you, O Lord. We worship you, Lord, because you are God. In the mighty name of Jesus. You are worthy, O Lord. In the name of Jesus. What a mighty God. We serve, hallelujah, what a mighty God. We serve, hallelujah, heaven and earth adore, even angels bow before him. What a mighty God we serve, hallelujah, what a mighty God we serve, oh yes, what a mighty God we serve, heaven and earth adore, even angels bow before him, what a mighty God we Thank you, Jesus. Our Bible reading is taken from the book of Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse 12. Book of Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse 22. Book of Second Chronicles, chapter 7, verse 14. Book of Proverbs, chapter 14, verse 12. Book of Matthew, chapter 10, verse 4. And book of Matthew, chapter 26, verse 41. Book of Second Timothy, chapter 4, verse 10. 
at this junction. Let's open our Bible to the book of Jeremiah chapter 3 verse 12 as we read our confession together. Go and proclaim this word toward the north and say, Return, thou backsliding Israel, sir the Lord, and I will not cause my anger to fall upon you, for I am merciful, sir the Lord, and I will not keep anger forever. Amen. Are you ready to that of God? Open your mouth and begin to give thanks to God. Give thanks to God for your life, for everything you are passing through, for your challenges, for your present situation. Open your mouth and say, Father, I thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, Lord, I say thank you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, Lord, because you are the Lord. Father, I say thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, for everything you have done. Glory be to your holy name. In Jesus' wonderful name we give thanks. Amen. Say, Father... Forgive me all my sins and cleanse me with the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to confess now. Say, Father, forgive me all my sins, every known and unknown sin. In the name of Jesus, Father, forgive me every sin in my life that has made me to backslide. Father, forgive me every sin in my life that has made me to fall into temptation. Father, forgive me in the name of Jesus. Father, forgive me, Lord, every known and unknown sin. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name we are forgiven. Amen. You will shout loud and clear. Say, my Father, have mercy on me. In the name of Jesus, my Father, have mercy on me. In the name of Jesus, my Father, have mercy on me. Open your mouth and ask for the mercy of God. In the name of Jesus, my Father, have mercy on me. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Father, have mercy on me. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I want us to double the aggression of our prayer. The wicked powers of your father's house, they want you to fall. The idols of your father's house, they want you to pass life. These are the agents of Satan. The assignment is to bring you down. Are you ready to pray? You will shout loud and clear. Say, I those of my father's house that want me to be rise and fall severally. Wherever you are, die in the name of Jesus. I those of my father's house that want me to be rise and fall severally. Wherever you are, die, 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 die in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray now. Every idol of your father's house that want you to rise and fall severally, they shall die in the name of Jesus. Die, 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 die. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Evil spirits that possess me to do what God hates, release me now and die in the name of Jesus. Evil spirit that possess me to do what God hates. Release me now and die in the name of Jesus. Release me now and die in the name of Jesus. Release me now and die in Jesus. Mighty name you are released. Amen. Say powers that want me to turn back from the Lord. Die in the name of Jesus. Powers that want me to turn back from the Lord. Die. Die, 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 in the name of Jesus. Die, 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 die. Powers that want me to turn back from the Lord. Die, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Say, Father, 
uproot every plant you have not planted in my life in the name of Jesus father uproot every plant you have not planted in my life in the name of Jesus father uproot any plant you have not planted in my life in the name of Jesus father uproot every plant you have not planted in my life in the name of Jesus in Jesus mighty name we pray amen we are still praying say oh lord fill me with your word daily in the name of jesus oh lord fill me with your word daily in the name of jesus oh lord fill me with your word daily in the name of jesus oh lord fill me with your word daily in the name of jesus in jesus mighty day we pray amen say oh lord deliver me from the grip of deadly and destructive habits that could lead to backsliding in the name of jesus oh lord deliver me from the grip of deadly and destructive habits that could lead to backsliding in the name of jesus oh lord deliver me from the grip of deadly and destructive habits that could lead to backsliding in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Say, in this Christian race, I shall not end up inside a fire. In the name of Jesus, in this Christian race, I shall not end up inside a fire. In the name of Jesus, I shall not end up inside a fire. In the name of Jesus, in this Christian race, I shall not end up inside a fire in the name of jesus in jesus mighty name we pray amen oh god of perfection perfect what is lacking in my faith and spiritual life in the name of jesus oh god of perfection make perfect what is lacking in my faith and spiritual life in the name of jesus oh god of perfection make perfect what is lacking in my faith and spiritual life in the name of jesus make perfect what is lacking in my faith and spiritual life in the name of jesus in jesus mighty day we pray amen say spirit of consistency in the teeth and vineyard of god possess me now in the name of jesus open your mouth and pray wherever you are spirit of consistency in the teeth and vineyard of god possess me now in the name of jesus possess me now spirit of consistency Consistency in the things and the fire of God possess me now in the name of Jesus possess me now in Jesus mighty name we pray amen grace of God to live above every temptation envelop my life in the name of Jesus grace of God to live above every temptation envelop my life in the name of Jesus envelop my life in the name of Jesus Jesus, envelop my life in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Say, Oh Lord, give me the grace to be disciplined. I say no to flesh and its work in my life. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord, give me the grace to be disciplined. I say no to flesh and its work in my life. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord, give me the grace to be disciplined. I say no to flesh and its works in my life. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus mighty day we pray amen fire of revival possess my life now in the name of jesus fire of revival possess my life now in the name of jesus fire of revival possess my life now in the name of jesus fire of revival possess my life now in the name of jesus in jesus mighty name we pray amen 
are anointed to keep moving in the vineyard of God. Follow me in the name of Jesus. Anointed to keep moving in the vineyard of God. Follow me in the name of Jesus. Follow me in the name of Jesus. Follow me in the name of Jesus. For, for, for in Jesus. Mighty name we pray. Amen. Say power that I needed for heaven to welcome me at the last day. Possess me now in the name of Jesus. Power that I needed for heaven to welcome me at the last day. Possess me now in the name of Jesus. Possess me now in the name of Jesus. Possess me now in the name of Jesus. Possess me now. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Are you ready to take the last prayer in this session? Say, where is the Lord God of Elijah? Arise and fight for me by fire. In the name of Jesus. Where is the Lord God of Elijah? Arise. Fight for me by fire. In the name of Jesus. Fight for me by fire. In the name of Jesus. Fight for me by fire. In Jesus. Jesus, mighty name we pray. Amen. Let's open our mouth and give thanks to God for the answer to our prayer. That we say thank you, Lord, because you have answered in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, King of Glory. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Lion of the tribe of Judah. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name we pray amen father in the mighty name of jesus father in the name of jesus lord we thank you because you are the lord that we will return all the glory unto thee blessed be your holy name in the name of jesus that we have cried unto thee O lord accept our thanksgiving in the name of jesus accept our worship in the mighty name of jesus let your name alone be glorified in the name of jesus heavenly father we come to your presence O lord father forgive and have mercy O lord in the mighty name of jesus father have mercy O lord in the mighty name of jesus in any area of our life that we might have backslided. Father, have mercy, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we have come back to you, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, according to your word, restore back every good thing we have lost in the mighty name of Jesus. Wherever your children has backslided, O Lord, Father, arise in your mercy. Have mercy, O Lord. Restore the fire and power back, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, we call upon you, O Lord, at this wonderful hour, in the mighty name of Jesus, because it is written in the book of Hosea chapter 14 verse 4, that how we heal their backsliding, I will love them freely, for my anger is turned away from him. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, because you are the Lord, manifest your power in the name of Jesus, in the life of each and every soul, under the sound of my voice, Father, in the name of Jesus, the spirit of sin no more. Father, release it, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. O God, arise. Release your fire of revival into their life. In the name of Jesus, let them do exploit in your vineyard. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, King of Glory. Daddy, we magnify your holy name. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' wonderful name we pray. Amen. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Brethren, I encourage us. Let us devote ourselves to prayer. Be watchful and thankful. God bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen.